Today, we're taking a focused dive into the world of cutting edge technology with the automotive grade T51 conductive polymer capacitor from Vichet. We'll cover the top five key aspects that set this capacitor apart. Let's embark on this journey to innovation and excellence. The ACQ200 standard is the benchmark for excellence in the automotive industry, a standard that is recognized and respected universally. It establishes a set of tests and qualifications to ensure a device is performing seamlessly, even under the most strenuous conditions. Vichet's latest entry into the automotive world, the T51 polymer capacitor, meets this standard. The T51 has undergone rigorous testing, pushing its limits both in specifications and packaging. It's certified to withstand 85 degrees C, 85% relative humidity, for a minimum of 1,000 hours at rated voltage. But it's not just about performance, it's about assurance. Assurance of not just utility, but also of safety and durability. Behind this innovation stands a name with deep roots and long-standing presence in the automotive industry, Vichet. A name synonymous with trust and pioneering breakthroughs. At Vichet, it's not just about setting standards, but also upholding them and continually raising the bar. The T51 is a testament to advanced engineering and meticulous design. With its ability to handle high ripple currents, this is not just about managing power, it's about mastering it. The design inherently minimizes heat dissipation and degradation in performance and life expectancy. This contributes to stability, ensuring the T51 doesn't just operate but thrives over an extended operational life. But what does that mean for the end user? It guarantees steady power delivery every time without fail. The core of the T51 isn't just about working, but working with unmatched efficiency and reliability. And in a world where demands spike without a moment's notice, Vichet stands ready supporting those rapid demands, ensuring that when the world asks, Vichet delivers. When we talk about innovation, we're often faced with the challenge of balance. With the T51, we've achieved just that, offering a remarkable compactness that doesn't waver on performance. Currently, we have the V-Case 7343-20 and D-Case 7343-31 available for your diverse needs. But innovation doesn't stop, and I'm thrilled to announce that the B-Case 3528-20 is on the horizon and will be joining our lineup soon. Why does this matter? Because these designs are tailor-made for high-density board configurations, streamlining your designs. With the T51 series, we're not just reducing the footprint, we're cutting down the weight and size of the PCBs. This isn't just evolution, it's a revolution in design, efficiency and space optimization. In the realm of technology, diversity often stands as a bridge between need and innovation. The T51 encapsulates this philosophy by offering a broad spectrum of capacitance and voltage ratings. The capacitance ranges from 2.2 microfarad up to 330 microfarad, and with an expansion to 470 microfarad coming soon. Voltage ratings from 2.5 volts to a robust 35 volts. With these ratings, the T51 has you covered. But it's not just about variety, it's about CV density. With its high volumetric efficiency, the T51 shines, offering more capacitance at any given voltage and package size compared to standard tantalum MNO2. As we delve into the meticulous engineering behind the T51, at its core, every single T51 device undergoes rigorous 100% surge current testing at full rated voltage. It's a testament to its resilience and our commitment to excellence. But our commitment doesn't stop at surge testing. Every parameter from capacitance to DF, ESR and DCL is evaluated 100% post-surge testing. This rigorous process ensures that we screen out weak dielectrics, ensuring that only the best make the cut. In our labs, we have a simple mantra, heal them or kill them. It epitomizes our drive to deliver devices that either meet our stringent standards or don't see the light of day. Because for us, quality isn't a checkbox, it's a pledge. We'll now take a step back into the realm of conductive polymer technology in general, highlighting the five things you should know. 
navigating the nuances and strengths of these capacitors that are replacing standard tantalums, MLCCs and aluminum electrolytics and defining future power designs. Let's dive in. What truly sets these devices apart is the heart, the conductive polymer cathode. This isn't just an advancement, it's a paradigm shift. Compared to the standard tantalum, otherwise known as MNO2, the conductive polymer cathode not only boasts a lower ESR, but also requires significantly less voltage durating. To break it down, for a device with a rated voltage of 10 volts or less, there's a mere 10% derating required, up to 105 degrees C. Devices with rated voltages greater than 10 volts only necessitate a 20% derating, a substantial improvement from the traditional 50% derating we see with the MNO2 traditional devices. However, as with all great innovations, there are boundaries. Beyond 105 degrees C, further derating is essential, continuing up to 125 degrees C. In a nutshell, the designer is able to fulfill their overall needs in a smaller package. As it stands today, the T51 boasts ESR values as low as 40 milliohms. But we're never ones to rest on our laurels. We're excited to share that an even more refined 25 milliohm version is on the horizon, with further expansions to even lower values planned in the future. It should be noted that other devices in Vichet's polymer family go as low as 6 milliohms already. Why is this significant? These values ensure that resistive losses and power dissipation are kept to a bare minimum, yielding higher efficiency. The T51 isn't just built for today, but it's optimized for the future, especially evident in its low impedance over a range of frequencies, making it a prime choice for high frequency applications. And for those concerned about long-term degradation, polymer holds up, experiencing significantly less wear from ripple current in essence, with conductive polymers, you're not just investing in a product, but in a promise of efficiency, durability, and stability through innovation. Safety, as we all know, is paramount in the world of technology. Unlike manganese dark side, polymer eliminates the chance of pyrotechnics due to the lack of oxygen molecules available. This means no fiery breakdowns and a world where energy storage and discharge aren't just efficient, but fundamentally safer. Such safety parameters are not mere perks, but necessities, especially when we venture into safety critical applications. Whether it's a medical device or a vital component in transportation, conductive polymer ensures dependability and risk mitigation. Going a step further, the T51 family member doesn't merely meet safety benchmarks, it aligns seamlessly with the stringent automotive safety standards emphasizing its commitment to safety in the most demanding environments. With the T51, you're investing in more than just a component, you're investing in peace of mind. In the ever-evolving world of technology, longevity and reliability are paramount. This is where the magic of conductive polymer cathodes comes into play. Specifically designed for extended operational life, these cathodes aren't merely built to last, but to excel throughout their life cycle. One of their defining traits is the absence of a wear-out mechanism. Imagine a component that retains its stability and efficiency, devoid of the typical degradation curves we've come to expect. But it doesn't stop there. These cathodes are embedded with a self-healing mechanism, an intrinsic ability to rectify and rejuvenate. The result? A system that not only stands the test of time, but maintains consistent performance metrics, ensuring that the device operates at its peak throughout its operational life. The measure of a truly superior component is not just how well it performs, but how consistently it does so across varying conditions. This is precisely the hallmark of our polymer technology. Conductive polymer showcases stable capacitance, ESR and DC leakage across high temperature at rated voltage and over extended periods. What does this mean for you? A component you can rely on, regardless of external conditions or the passage of time. Furthermore, one of the standout features of conductive polymer is its capacitance behavior. Unlike MLCC, its capacitance doesn't fluctuate with DC bias. This translates to reliability and performance, a trait every designer and engineer seeks. 
And here's a feature that speaks volumes about its evolutionary design. Its DC leakage doesn't remain static. Instead, it decreases over time, enhancing the overall efficiency and operational safety of the device. In essence, with conductive polymer, you get a component that's not just designed for the present, but is future ready.